Biology is pretty simple. We cover only from the smallest atom to the biggest thing being the biosphere, which is the Earth. So we cover everything else in between those, and that's it. First semester for students are pretty hard because you learn everything that is smaller than one organism, like the organs, the cells, and the atoms and elements. So students, they jump into biology and then all of a sudden they're just learning about these tiny little things that they never seen or heard of, and that's why it's pretty hard. The second semester, it gets easier because you learn about things that are bigger than one organism. Uh, like you learn about population, a bunch of animals, you learn about plants and all those stuff. So it's much easier in the second semester. So in biology, we start with the smallest thing, atoms and element. How are those two related? Atoms is very general, elements very specific. Think for example like cars and brand names. Like cars is very general, cars is just cars and a specific brand name of cars are like Toyota and Honda. Those are very specific. So like an element is specific of an atom like oxygen and hydrogen. Those are specific. Think of it like brand name elements of an atom. And then a bunch of atoms and elements put together, you get molecules, you put those molecules together, you get macromolecules, and then you have organelles, and you have cells, and then you have tissues, and then organs, and organ system, and then you have one whole organism, like a human, or like an animal. And then when you have a bunch of those all together, you have like populations, and communities, and ecosystem, and then the biosphere. Biosphere life, bio life, spear, it's spear, so biosphere is earth. So basically in biology, it's just that simple. You cover everything from the atom, the smallest thing, to the biosphere being the largest thing known. Now you were to focus on the atoms and elements and you study everything about the atoms and elements, like how it works, how things combine all the names, then that's chemistry. And then if you study anything beyond the biosphere, beyond the earth, outside in the universe and stuff, that's astronomy. But if you study everything between it, that's biology. So when you're studying biology, make sure you keep these things in mind. These are called the levels of biological organization. And it goes in order from smallest and then it gets larger and larger. And then eventually it reaches the biosphere being the largest. And that's pretty much it for biology. So you see, biology is pretty easy. Besides the fact you have Mr. Dole to help you out.